Hey everybody, welcome back to another Horror Mystery Box Unboxing, and it bounced around USPS for way too long. It was supposed to be on a Monday. It is now Wednesday. Uh, it is the Wrong Place, Right Time BAM Plus. Now this is the horror. They were also running a uh, like fantasy quest, I think is what it was called, was the theme for that one. But we all know that when they put out two themes, such as the fantasy and the horror, that it will be the same actor, just different images. So our detective work. Uh, I have a pretty good idea who this is. I will say it. Uh, with her signing being complete around the same time this was supposed to ship and all, everything that was going on and the hints of like what it was and then the fantasy, it really, it was like, ah, oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is who it is. And I think it's Liv Tyler. I think it is her image from The Strangers. I'm hoping we're right, because I'd love to have a lift high. That'd be really awesome. Everybody's getting them. They look really awesome. So we will go ahead and pop this open and see what we got. Now, usually in their plus boxes, it comes with like art, patch, because they started doing patches with their plus, and they haven't done one in a while, but it's supposed to be like patches, art, stuff like that. We did get the battered and bruised, I think is what it's called. I have no idea what that is. I don't, I've not heard a, th a hint or a theory on who it's going to be, but they were offering a uh, 11 by 14 with an art and a patch, a prop with an art and a patch, or you get the uh, brutal, you know, collection or whatever that came with the 11 by 14, the prop, two art, and then two patches. So we went with that one. So I'm hoping it's awesome. I hope it comes soon. You know, next month would be awesome to get it. But let's go ahead and we will crack it open and see if we're right. All right, now there is nothing else in the envelope. We'll trash that. And we have it sandwiched nice and comfy with blue tape and cardboard. So let's go ahead and get to it. Now, it's pretty thick, and they did actually send it in um, a protector, and it looks like there's more than one thing in here. So they might have done an art piece or something that they just didn't tell us about. Ooh, the cheat sheet sliding out. We won't look at it. Uh, come on. All right. First up is the art piece, and that's a pretty cool art piece, and I think we're right, unless they did an art piece separate from what the actual autograph is. If you remember, we did the Christian Bell. We got a Christian Bell uh, art piece and autograph, so I'm thinking it might be Liv Tyler. I think we might be right, so let's go ahead and flip it and see what we got if I can get it unstuck. All right, that is actually really awesome. I like the image they used. She has a, a, a good autograph. But it is who we think it is. It is. There's a glare. Ugh. That is Liv Tyler. I like how they have her in like three different like scenes here in this image. And then her autograph here, Liv Tyler. Now, I've seen a lot of them. Uh, she put hearts on it. And Josh was really hoping for a heart because it just... He said it would add to how dark and twisted the movie is if she put a heart with her name. And I thought, yeah, that would that'd be really cool. So, you know, that'd be cool if she, she put them on these. But she did not, so it looks good. And, yeah, right place, wrong time. It's especially horror. Plus, they did not let us know who it was. But on this advertisement, it does say Liv Tyler of the Strangers. And then we had the option for two images and the art. Only one thing for the art. I actually really like our image. The other image is nice too. Especially if you want to do a cast piece with Kip Weeks and the others. Because, you know, you would have her in the middle and you can get her to sign up around them. But I really like ours because of just... She's getting the shit beat out of. <laughs> and then her crawling around and stuff. That is very cool. I'm very happy about it. It's very awesome. Good job, bam. Now I'm excited to get, you know, our next plus to see what kind of uh, autograph and uh, prop and stuff they're going to use. I would like to see their patches, too. But that's everything. If you want to check them out, I think the uh, new Horror Plus is still available. I'm not sure. I haven't checked. It was last week when I purchased it. If you want to go check them out, go to thebandbox.com, and that's where you can find this stuff. Or you could go to their social medias, which is the band box at Facebook and Instagram. Uh, their card trade in finishes on the 30th. So if anybody has any extra common cards laying around that they don't want, like they have like two or three they can't do nothing with, you can send them to me. I'll take them. 
because uh, we've got almost enough to start sending in and stuff. I'm hoping to get some really cool uh, pieces back. Because I've just been, you know, seeing if anybody had any extra that they didn't want or whatever to send in to me. And, you know, we could we can send them out, see if we get anything good back. Uh, you know, whenever my buddy Shane did it with me, he got two boxes. And I still need to grab a few cards from him, but I think there are only three. So, but if you liked everything, please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. And I really, really hope to see you guys next time.